Welcome to In Step with Fort Riley. I'm Scott Rhodes. Fort Riley in the central Flint Hills region bid a fond farewell to Garrison Commander Colonel Andrew Cole Jr. in a ceremony July 13th at Riley's Conference Center here on Post. Colonel Cole, after a three-year stint as Garrison Commander, passed the colors to Colonel John Lawrence. Inclement weather moved the ceremony indoors and the house was packed with soldiers, civilian employees and community members wanting one last chance to express their gratitude to Colonel Cole for his leadership. The Garrison Command, as we all know, is a very unique command and requires a very special and socially adept person in order to be successful. And frankly, that's what Andrew and Charlotte are, just great people. Under his leadership, Fort Raleigh has been the example for the entire Army. This year, our garrison was named the best installation in DOD. Most of you know that the senior leader commands are usually about two years, but Andrew and Charlotte trooped the line for three years, and he did so in a physically constrained environment, never losing focus or vigor, and most importantly, passion and energy. Colonel Cole praised the Fort Riley workforce for their efforts despite less than ideal conditions and thanked the community for its continuing support. The garrison has been through some challenging times throughout my tenure. This workforce has weathered a reduction in force, as well as seen no relief in their support mission as they enable combat readiness for the 1st Infantry Division. Nonetheless, our workforce has continued to strive for and achieve excellence. The reason Fort Riley truly is the best place to live, train, deploy from, and come home to is because of the support provided, the support provided to us by our community. Many of you are in the audience today and I want to say thanks to you. Your enduring and unwavering support is indispensable to making Fort Riley and the 1st Infantry Division what it is today. I will always measure a community's support by what I've seen and lived here. My name is Andrew Cole and I'll always be a Big Red One soldier. Support and defend, duty, first, service, always. Colonel Lawrence, I wish you the best. You've got a, you've got a prideful and proud team, and I know you will take care of them and do well. Everyone, thanks again for coming out today. Colonel Cole, thank you. I would like to uh, thank you personally for your professional transition and the time you personally took to give me insights into this command. It's going to be of great uh, help as I go forward. Lastly, I'd like to give special thanks to my wife and my son, for without their support, I'd not be standing here before you today. To the units, garrison staff, Fort Riley partners, local officials, and leaders, I look forward to working with each and every one of you as we move forward to the future as teammates. Duty first, service always. I'm Colonel John Lawrence, and I am and always have been a Big Red One soldier. Thank you. Colonel Lawrence takes command of the Fort Riley Garrison after serving as the garrison commander at Bagram Airfield in Afghanistan. Meanwhile, Colonel Cole is headed to Fort Benning, Georgia to become the Chief of Staff of the Maneuver Center of Excellence. Fort Riley's fitness centers are now offering the Body Pump Workout. Body Pump is for anybody looking to get lean, toned, and fit in a hurry. I could sure use that. Using light to moderate weights and lots of repetition, Instructors will coach you through scientifically proven methods and techniques to keep you encouraged and motivated, all the while burning up to 540 calories in a session. That's right, folks, I said 540. The very first unit physical training session using the body pump workout, which you're looking at video of here, was conducted recently, and yes, even your unit can take part. If you'd like to schedule a unit training session or just find out more about body pump, visit the Fort Riley Fitness Facebook page You'll find class schedules there, or call your favorite fitness center to schedule a unit or group class. And for more news and information about Fort Riley, check out the 1st Infantry Division Post newspaper. Grab a hard copy from a newsstand near you, or visit onedivpost.com. You can also find out more by checking out the Fort Riley website at riley.army.mil. I'm Scott Rhodes, and you're in step with Fort Riley. We'll see you next time.